Let me just. I just give him uh, look at you and then be shy and <laughs> sad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is a Mickey so hard. Hard But it's a girl or a boy? It's a girl, no? It's a girl or a boy? Yes, it's a boy. Boy. Yeah. <laughs> How on history? But we also have a cat at home. I have a cat uh -huh. at home. This is my friend's house. I'm just staying here because it's quiet here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so today we're going to study, continue studying about um, food. Food here. Yeah. Right? We talked about this last time. Yeah, meal. meals. So are we on this page, the issue, or are we on this question? Yeah, we finished. Uh, the three questions. Question. Okay, so we are here. Yeah. Correct? Yes. Okay. Yes. <laughs> is, your, is your cat playful with you? Just with you? Your cat? Are you playing with your cat always? Just with you? What? what? Uh, I mean, are you playing with your cat most of the time? Yes. <laughs> Does he only this play is, with you? When we have, when we have, uh, um, a cash, uh, a kitty, I don't want to go out with my friend. Oh, just, you want to have me time? Same with my friend. He would always want to be with the dog. And yeah. then he would always say, ah, I have to go home because of my dog. Same with you. So I I have to work on day, so my cat um so so sad. If I don't have uh at home, I my sister don't have uh don't don't have at home, and uh they just sleep sleep oh. all day. And my 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 mother and my father touch me, call me. He they so upset, and it's a lot. But if um uh, my uh me and my sister at home so sad, so sad. <laughs> he misses you is he is she a girl the cat girl or boy a uh, boy oh he misses uh, you i i smell oh i'm a nice a doctor nice. told me they too fast <laughs> you know what sunny they say if you're an animal lover if you have pet you're a kind person are you a yeah. kind person yeah a thank you sweet and a caring person because you're caring for your pet okay so quest let's go to the lesson today okay so last time yes. we talked about the meals the yes. breakfast the lunch, lunch and the dinner okay so this yeah. uh the meals that we do not enjoy anymore because we tend to skip having this important meal you shared with me last time that before you're not taking breakfast but you are now mm -hmm. now um you you now know that breakfast is the most important meal of the day Okay, so are we on question number one or we stopped at a certain number? We uh, we finished uh, number six. Number, number six. six, okay. So this yeah. is, we are on number seven. Uh, what is your favorite dessert, Sunny? Oh my gosh, <laughs> it's so a lot. <laughs> <laughs> are like... you a sweet tooth? You like sweets? Yeah. Okay, yes. when you like, if you like sweets, um, they are called sweet tooth, tooth, tooth person, sweet tooth. You like sweets very much. <laughs> what does it mean? Um, it's like as as um, they they call a person sweet tooth because those people who like sweets, like cake, like chocolates, like ice cream, they are called you sweet. You can write tooth. in the chat. 
po? Ah, sorry. I, I don't know. You did not get it. Okay, wait. I like sweet. Yes, sweet. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, can't see the chat box. Wait, I'll write it here. Sweet tooth. There. It's just uh, another another word for the person who likes dessert. Mm, I know. If you like yeah, dessert very much, you are called sweet tooth. Uh, sweet tooth. Yes. Okay. Number seven, what's your favorite dessert? Think of the best. I know there's a lot. I know the line is very long, but what's your best, the, the, the most favorite of all? It's uh the best the uh, the best uh, on because if we uh about uh dishes we need to uh we we eat uh them before uh after you finish the yes. you finish the the, the, meal. the meal yes uh, I think I I prefer food then I prefer food. Uh, then sweet because sweet I just like uh it uh eat them in the afternoon um after uh, we take a rest and we need to some sweet and uh, if we uh we eat dessert uh, after the meal I will for fruits then that. okay so do you like so do you like can candies cakes what what flavor of do you like cake yes what flavor um chocolate and uh, strawberry yeah. <laughs> <laughs> strawberry chocolate. shortcake and chocolate yeah. oh. um we have uh, uh i like the I like chocolate, really chocolate. That also, um, what's that? Uh, cream cheese, like blueberry cheesecake. Something. Yeah, this good, good, so good, good with good coffee. Good. Yeah. <laughs> um, what's your favorite chocolate brand? Um. Oh, do you know M M M M M M M Yes. The plain or with nuts? Yes. And uh, some, uh, um, I I eat a lot of chocolate, but <laughs> I I like uh, the flavor. It's uh, chocolate, a uh, bitter. Ah, Not the dark the dark sweet. chocolate. Yes, yes. Yes, the dark chocolate. Yes. Yeah. Um, they say um, chocolate brings happiness if you're sad. <laughs> okay. And if you uh, if you stress. I think we need to eat yes, uh, chocolate. Yes, yes, yes. Chocolate. yes, yes. If you, uh, it gives us energy. Okay. Yeah. Um, you like milk tea also? That's sweet. You like milk tea? Huh? Milk tea. Bit... Boba milk tea. Tea with milk. Milk tea. Ah, uh -uh, milk tea. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like milk tea, but I like milk tea, but. Because um some of the time uh we uh, we have a uh, friend um bubble beauty yes but, yes bubble milk tea uh, uh, that time I I just drink I also drink a lot of milk tea but <laughs> if you ask me uh, uh milk tea and coffee and I like coffee. I prefer coffee. Ah, coffee better. And, yes. So now I um, with my friend. Yeah, but now I, I like coffee. Better. Coffee better. When you start work, when you are working, I think you prefer coffee more yeah. than the milk tea. Yeah. Because it keeps you alive. I mean, it gives it gives you more energy. Okay. Next. Um, number eight. Yes. Okay, and number eight. in the morning, this is my protein. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It gives you energy. Do you usually want to pay for your... That's true, that's no. true. Yes. Yeah. 
Um, I think, um, no, I don't. I just, um, uh, I just um, uh, cook, uh, cook, the, uh, cook the meal and, uh, uh, and uh, give for everyone uh, for homeless. Yes, yes, yes. I, yes. I don't pay for uh, your, I don't pay the, the meal uh, for the worker lunch, but uh, I have, you uh, don't. I, I used to uh, volunteer for the, um, yes. I, I cook, I cook in, with my uh, family and my friend and um, and so uh, homely in the COVID time we my, my family uh, do that, did that wow wow really wow so not, no that's really a good deed uh, a kind deed um, giving and my uh, my best friend my best friend uh, buy one uh, uh, by uh, a lot of vegetable and uh, uh, a lot of food and give to the homeless and uh, poor person. Wow, well, that's so nice to hear, Sunny. Not everyone did that during the pandemic. Uh, when people, when other people have no work and no money to buy food and you did an extra work of giving to others. That is so nice. Congratulations yeah. to your good work. Very good. You, your friend, and your family. Yes. Did, can, can you hear me? Yes, I can okay. hear you. Yes, yes. <laughs> okay. So my cat is so noisy. <laughs> Playing with you. Okay. So um, question number eight is, do you usually volunteer to pay for your fellow workers? Um, you're not paying for uh, your fellow workers, but you would rather cook and then give to the homeless. Yes, I think because I think that's better yeah. because you and your friends, um, I think you can all afford to buy food of your own and giving to other people is a good deed. Thank you for your good work. Okay, now let's go to uh, question number nine. What do you think about the street? What does it mean? I don't uh, know. That street? Yeah, yes, I think um, that this is another way of um, saying pay for your own food. Paying for your own food. That's a Dutch treat. They just call it Dutch treat. Uh, I think Dutch, the Dutch people do this. They pay for their own food and they don't ask others to pay for their food. I... Yes. Okay, wait. Um, I'll just check another uh, an example for this. yes like example when you you and your friends go out um ah, sorry you and your friends go out and then um you go to a restaurant you go to mm. example a coffee shop and then um example that five of you you go to the coffee shop and then the, the the nearest to the cashier you you can tell that person that you buy you pay for it you, you have to pay for everyone example they say sunny pay for everyone's uh, coffee and then you can tell your friends no dutch street meaning they have to pay for their own coffee You pay, paying or on your own money, paying for your for the food that you ordered, uh, paying on your own. Okay. 
understood. Yeah, I'm going to show you a video of the Dutch street. The street encourage to your 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 tell your your explain. It mean like yeah when we go to the coffee shop yes. and um uh, with my uh, with my friend and they uh they tell me uh, uh I need to pay uh, the bill for all of us. Yes, yes. When when no, but, when but your, your I, when no no when your friend tells you to pay uh, the bill for everyone, no, that's not that street. That street is paying for your own. When people share cost, the cost of something, um, they, uh, there are times when um, like when we are with friends. Sometimes what we do is to ask someone to pay for everyone's, uh, um, to pay for uh, the total bill. Example, that's it. What if uh, you have no money? So it's better that when you go out with friends, you tell your friend that let's have a Dutch treat, meaning um, everyone will give their share of the bill. Everyone will pay all, will pay for the food that they ordered. So um sharing sharing for, for 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 the total bill. That's that street. Okay. A uh, big um example we are with friends. Sometimes we tell our friend, a certain friend, you pay for everyone, you pay for everyone. Uh, that's not that street. A uh, that street is um example the five of you. Your total bill is uh, $1,000. So $1,000 uh, divided to the your five people, you and your friends. Yes. <laughs> okay. Because when we are with friends, uh, sometimes we tell them, no, you pay for our drink, pay for our drink, like that. But um, what if that person or that friend has no money? Um, so she, he or she has to shoulder everyone's bill. So that is the, um, the bad side of um, paying for everyone's bill. The example, you're used, they are used to paying, they are used to um, you paying for everyone's uh, coffee or you paying for everyone's food. So what if, Sunny, you don't have money to pay? Do you just tell your friends, I, I cannot go out, I'm sick. But that the, the, the real, uh, what, is the, the, uh, what is the story behind? Okay, so um, it's not that you are sick, but it's, it's just because you don't have money to pay for their food or for their coffee. So it's like another way of saying, a sharing of bill, that street sharing of bill. Did you understand? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I got so, it. Yeah, understand. Yes. Okay, number 10. Yeah. Do you think it's a good idea to take a nap after? This, uh, I think this is a not good idea, but I do that every day. <laughs> <laughs> it's called power nap. That's why we have lunch. <laughs> a short nap, a yeah. quick nap. Because the, yeah, because the lunch time is so short. So uh, we, uh, we have to learn, uh, we have to, to uh, have a learn uh, quickly and yes. Take uh, a nap. Let, let time we need to take a nap to <laughs> take uh, energy for, for yes war. that's true that's true you have to take a nap plus the idea that you are so full um it makes you sleepy that's why after eating yeah. you are sleepy there um yes you're correct uh, let's have a power nap or a quick nap 
um, so that we have energy to do our work the whole day. Okay, now let's go to number 11. Do you think one hour is enough time for lunch? I think, um, I think uh, a half hour uh, is uh, enough time for lunch. But uh, yes, I think that. Um, I think, yes, yes, you're right. Uh, yes, it's uh, one hour if enough. Um, at work, you only need to work eight hours and adding a few more uh, of the time, like 30 minutes or another hour for your break, meaning you have to stay longer in the office, right? So I think um, one hour is just enough so that you can also go home and rest um, after um, after the eight-hour shift or the eight-hour work, right? Okay, so instead of um, uh, going home at 6 p.m. because you want longer time, example, yeah. you went uh, to work at 8 a.m. So eight hours of work plus one hour, that's nine hours. So um, instead of going home at 5 o'clock p.m., so you have to wait another hour or so because you have to complete the eight-hour shift. Okay, now let's go to number 12. Yes. What time your favorite fruit? Mm, a lot. <laughs> I have a, a lot of favorite fruit. What's the, the uh, most? I like uh, my Vietnamese food. Yes. The more I think right, I think my, uh, I think uh, this is the, uh, I think my favorite first is uh, uh, my food, uh, is the food my, uh, my mom make it. Wow, yes, that's true. My mom, yeah, my mom, my mom can, can cook everything. Wow. I don't know why, but wow. she can cook yes. everything. Yes, that's true. And sometimes, so yes, that's so true. That sometimes it, um, we want to order food, but home cooked food is still the best, right? Yeah. Home cooked food is the best. Yeah. What's the favorite food that your mom cooks? What's your favorite food? Mm, What's the best the food that Vietnam mom cooks? Uh, this is the Vietnamese. Yeah, this fo, is the fo, fo, fo. like fo, is that the fo? Wait, wait, wait. Um, I think I ate one before. There's no chat here. Okay. Is it right? Right? Is this right? Mm. Ah, pho noodle. Yes, yes, noodle. Pho? Yes. Pho. Your mom cooks good pho? Yes. Uh, uh, yes, uh, she can cook. It's so yummy. Yes. <laughs> she, can, she can cook. She can uh, pho. She can wow. cook pho. Oh, it's, yes. how, do you, how do you say it? Hmm? How do you say it? Pho? Pho. Pho. Fa. Uh, fa. Fa. Ah. ah, okay, ah. <laughs> wow, nice, nice. Okay, good. She cooks good yeah. fa. Ah. fa. You like that? Yes, I like. Yeah. I like noodle and rice. Ah, noodle and rice, wow. Okay, yeah. next, let's go to before we starve, before we feel hungry. Let's go to number um, to 13. Do you like Western 13. food? Do you like Western food? Yes, do you like Western food? It's so quick. Which? Oh, what mm. is that uh, Western food? I think this is the uh, and um, 
Yeah. And pasta. Oh, pasta. Yes, sandwich, uh, burger. Those are um, uh, Western food. Yes. Um, who, yeah. who doesn't want hamburger? Yeah. <laughs> and French fries. That is the typical um, Western yeah. food. Uh, chicken nuggets like that. <laughs> Hot dog sandwich like that. Bacon. You like that? Sunny. <laughs> Not so much. You like that, Sunny. Okay, Sunny, let's go. Number 14. I think I don't have to ask you this because... Sunny, can you hear me? Sunny, can you hear me? It's now here. Yes, not yes, yes, yes. Okay, so do you yeah. do, do? I think I don't have to ask you this because you said already yeah. that you like coffee. <laughs> yes, so I think every yeah. meal you have coffee. Am I right? Do you have coffee every mm. meal? Yes. Uh, but. Uh, you, you, you ask me là do, do I like drink coffee or drink beer? Yes, what, what? What? Do you like coffee or do you drink beer? What do you prefer? Coffee or beer? I do both of them. <laughs> I do both of them. <laughs> because coffee makes me feel uh, fresh. In the uh, and uh, uh, I need to coffee for my uh, for 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 working, but but um but beer <laughs> no make me <laughs> relax. <laughs> so no time to work and, anymore. Uh, um and. Sa kanya. Sunny, can you hear me? Sunny? <coughs> Sunny, can you hear me? Can yeah, you hear me? Can... Yeah, yeah, I can. Can you hear me? Yes, yes, now I can hear you now. And then a while ago, uh, you went out of the screen. Your camera was off. Okay, so let's continue. I think there's internet problem. I'm not sure where, why. Okay, it's becoming slow. slow. Okay, so next. Yeah. Um, okay, num let's go to number 15. Um, how many cup uh, of coffee do you drink a day? Just one. In the morning. One in the morning. The morning routine. Yes. That. Yes, one for morning. Okay, I'm not sure what's happening. I'm not sure what's happening. Wait. Yeah. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes. I. I turned off my camera. I'm not sure whose yeah, yeah. internet is low, if yours or mine. Um, so that's why I turned off my camera. Na lang. Okay, I, I will turn. Sunny? Yes, <laughs> Yeah. 
Sunny. Nalasas naman sa akin, sir. Oo, 87 eh. Sunny, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes, yes, I can. Okay, good. I'll just I just turn off your camera, maybe. Yeah. Okay. So, I uh, just tell me if I you cannot hear me. Okay. So let, now let's go to number fifteen. How many cups of coffee do you drink? You answered that. You said once a day only, just to keep you going, to give you the energy for the day. Very good. Number sixteen. Do you try to maintain a balanced diet? Um, I'm, I'm, I'm not uh, trying uh, yes. Yeah, you, you're not dieting. But uh, in your meal every day, do you have um, meat, vegetable? Yeah. And fruits? Mm, yeah. Yes. Okay. So that is a balanced diet. If you have, um, because when it, when we talk of Western food, um, people think that if they eat burger, just tell me if you don't understand what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I understand. Okay. So, um, for number sixteen, maintain a balanced diet. But the balanced diet meaning you have meat. You have uh, rice, you have um, vegetable, and then you have fruits. Uh, for other people, the West they think that Western food is already a complete meal. Why? The bread is um, like the rice also. And then they have the meat, and then they have a little vegetable like the lettuce and uh, tomato. But because of... The, the meat, there is fatty. So it's not really a, a meal. A burger is not a complete meal. So it's not healthy, unlike what others are saying. Okay? So do you try to maintain a balanced diet? I think if you have, um, if you have meat or fish, you have rice, and then you have vegetable, and then you have um, fruits, that's a balanced diet. Okay, now let's go to number 17. Yeah. Do you, can you please read? Usually, do you usually buy fruits in the department store or in the market? So do you, where do you buy fruits? Um, actually, my mom is uh, on way uh, buy fruits in the market. Yes. Um, yeah, but uh, I, uh, but I, uh, but I, uh, Usually buy fruits in the department store or supermarket. Yes, yes, correct. Supermarket, yes, yes supermarket. No, because uh, actually my mom is on way buy fruits in the market. This is the Vietnamese fruits. Yes, yes, yes. very and fresh. Yes, yes. But this is the Vietnamese fruit. But sometimes my uh, my family like uh, like um. Uh, want to eat some cherry, um, kiwi, uh, some, uh, something, uh, some food, uh, in the, in the Western food. Yes, yes. That. So I need to buy it in the, uh, supermarket. supermarket. Yes. yes, that's true. Um, just be careful that when you buy, I think the question here is, 
um, when you buy from um, um, the market, are you sure that it's uh, fresh? Because yeah. it is like what you said in the market of of um, uh, Vietnamese uh, market, you are sure that they are fresh. Right, yeah. um, but when you buy in the department store, because sometimes some of these uh, fruits are imported, just make sure that they are still they are organic, something like that, organic, or you yeah. know that it's not from China, <laughs> right? Yes, yes, Be- yes. Because um, we 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 watch from uh, from from the news and from. Uh, um, using the internet sometimes they are trending why because they are selling fake fake fruits fake food right uh, these are from china and it's really scary um, imagine you eating um, plastic food uh, yeah. made from china have you yeah. heard of that yes i on what i heard a lot of that Right? Yeah, and, and I'm so I'm so care, but uh, when I go to the uh, uh, supermarket, uh, some um, somehow to buy um, first, I I will I uh I yeah uh, I on way uh, ask my friend and my uh, uh, my coworker uh, the store is uh, good have a good first. Yes. something like that uh, make sure um, okay. yeah and uh, give me some uh, feedback or uh, review uh, the store the fruit yes. store yes 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 that's true you have to make sure that they are fresh and they are they did not come from china okay yeah. wait lang um, sunny i'm just going to get uh, my charger yeah Okay, sorry, I got low bad. Sorry, I got low, but okay, Sunny, next. Um, we are we are doing one hour today. Is it okay with you? Okay. Okay. So, um, do you? Uh, yes, we already answered number seventeen. Now let's go to number eighteen. Are you worried about pesticides when pesticides? Pesticides. Mean- what does it mean? Uh, pesticides. Yes. What does it mean, pesticide? Um, pesticide, like chemicals, the one that they spray um, to kill the um, insects that eat the, um, the, the plants or the fruits when they spray something. So I'll show you pesticides. Can you see? Uh, 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 yeah, I, I, I got it. I got yes, it. There. So those are pesticides. Uh, uh, uh. When, when they spray something on the, uh, ke- chemicals, chemicals that they spray on food. So yeah, I, I, I also worry about it. So yes. when I, uh, when I uh, eat the vegetable or fruit, uh, uh, or anything, uh, be- um, before uh, my family cook or uh, eat something, uh, we uh, we have to uh, we need to wash it. And, Very good. Uh, yes. Yes. Uh, like if uh, uh, like uh, vegetable fruit or uh, meat, uh, yes. we we need to uh, uh, to wash with the soap. Yes. Big. Yes. 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 Or sometimes they put it in a baking. Uh, water with baking soda 
Um, so yeah. to uh, make sure that it's really the, the best, it's really clean. Um, before people are used to eating fresh fruits uh, from the market, straight from the market, and then they, they buy the the food, the fruit. But now I think you have to be very very careful of the chemicals on the skin of the fruits. Yeah. Especially this kind of uh, fruit. Number 19. Do you peel your apple? What does it mean? Um, peel, yeah, peeling meaning taking off the skin. This one. This is peeling the apple. Can you see it? <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's peeling the apple. Um, again, uh, if you are not sure of where the where the fruit came from, you have what well, taking they say taking off the skin is also uh, making sure that you take off the chemical that was sprayed on the fruit. Okay, since um since only cold countries have um, a, a grow apple, so they, I don't know if you've heard of um, apples from China. Again, China, yeah. nothing against China. I'm sorry, China. I'm not against China. But because of what I hear from the news um, that uh, they, they grow uh, they put chemicals so that um, their fruits uh, look fresh and big. Yes. Something like that. Right? I, I'm, I'm really scared. Um, I think they put like, uh, you know the chemical that they put, they put to preserve the dead, example, mm. dead person. Mm. It's called formalin. And they say that um, so that the fruit will not, the apples will not um, dry something like that it won't dry up easily they spray it with formalin so it's really imagine yourself eating something with chemical so it's like poisoning your body right okay. I hope you understood okay Sunny are you still there Yes, I yes. Okay. So this is the new word that we uh, learned today. Um, number one word, please read. The stress and yes, occupation when people share the cost of something shared at a meal in the restaurant. Yes. Yeah. That's it. Yes, uh, giving your share. Not just one person who will uh, pay for the total bill, but everyone will pay for the total bill. Okay, mm -hmm. number two word. Petsai. Yes, very a chemical, good. It's a, a chemical used to kill harmful insects. Yeah. Yes, chemicals that is sprayed on the fruits or the plants so that the insect will, will die. Okay, so imagine yourself eating something that is sprayed with pesticide. It's like um, killing your poisoning. Yeah, it's like drinking or eating poison also. Here, right? Okay, now let's go to the new lesson. It's um, opinion samples. Okay, you okay. can try to read it. Are you ready, Sunny? Yeah. Okay, can you kindly read? And then later I'm going to um, yeah. tell you what for, the words were. For too long, we have helped that, that common culture. Uh, demand that one people pay for everything, everyone's meal. Uh, of, uh, oftentimes, this leads to an embarrassing struggle over who will buy. Uh, of course, each uh, person uh, is expected to take turn, uh, but the order is not always clear, and this may lead to resentment uh, by the order. Meal costs are also continually rising, so pay, paying for 
multiple meal as one time is often inconvenient. We could save yourself a lot of trouble if we would agree to go that each pay for his own meal. Yes, very good. Nice reading, um, Sunny. Um, there is only one word that you have that hard time pronouncing. It's this word, courtesy. Yes, yes, yes. Can you please say courtesy? Courtesy. Yes, very good. And the uh, most of the hard words were um uh, pronounced correctly. Embarrassing. I heard you say embarrassing. That's correct. Yeah. Struggle. Very good. I also heard you say the word resentment, resentment. slowly but surely. Very good. Yeah. And then constantly. constantly. Good. Yes, very good. Constantly. And then multiple. Very good. You tried the uh, reading this. It's good. Um, and then inconvenient. Inconvenient. Yes, very good. And uh, uh, well, overall, good job. Okay. So uh, what do you think is the meaning of this um, essay or paragraph? Uh, I think um, it's talk about uh, uh, the person who, who will pay the meal. If we have a, uh, you know, if we have a, a meal with my friend, but uh. I don't, uh, I don't understand clearly uh, for detail this uh, for a phrase. Okay, so um, yes, yes, and uh, yes, uh, paying for the food that you eat when you have when you and your friends go outside um, and then uh, eat in the restaurant. Um, sometimes we only ask one person to pay for the food. And um, can, can you hear me? Yes, 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 I can hear you. So, so when your friend would say, um, when one that when that friend uh has like, example, it's always you, uh, Sunny, please pay for our food, Sunny, please pay for our food. Then the next time that you will go out, they would always say, they would still say, Sunny, pay for everyone, and then um, although you don't want to. Um, tell them that I don't want to pay. I don't want mm -hmm. to pay. But it has to be like uh, each one will have their turn to pay. But what if that friend's that friend when it's her turn to pay is not around? So who will pay? It's you who's going to pay again. And then the next time that you go outside, that friend yeah. again is absent. <laughs> that friend is not here. So you will pay again. So um, they say that it's not fair because sometimes they skip. It's not clear who is going to pay. Okay. So there, um, the the paragraph is or the essay is suggesting that it's better to um, pay your own food. Okay. When you order. You order for yourself, you pay it, uh, you pay for yourself. That's it. As simple as that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So next. It. Yes, next. Okay, number two, please read. Um, I'm very concerned about getting uh poisonous by what I eat. I can never be sure if any food. Uh, a yeah, uh, but pesticide free even after I wash it. So I try to peel it uh, before I eat it uh, at a result. result. I try on way from some of my favorite foods like strawberry might have is more important uh, than my palate. Yes, palate. yes, yes, correct. Okay, so yes, you tried reading um, concerned, very good. And then poisoned, very good. And then very good, you read pesticide free uh, with confidence. And then result, good, it was pronounced correctly. 
Favorite food, correct. Strawberries, correct. Uh, important, correct. Last one, palette. palette. This last word, it's called palette. Palette. Yes. Okay. Did you understand what this um, passage means? What is the meaning of this uh, paragraph? Um, I think... Uh, um, I guess it talk about um, uh, uh, pesticide and um, uh, and um, and, uh, and 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 uh, uh, talk uh, talk everyone need to watch. What's the what the the, the, the food that uh, before we eat and if this is uh need to peel it like um peel it yeah yes peel okay so there you're correct um it's talking it talks about the pesticide or the chemicals or the, the one that is sprayed on the fruits and the plants and the other um, um, vegetables. Um, yes, they, um, they choose to wash it before eating it. And as a result, in the end, um, they don't want to eat fruit that has no skin or the, the, the small fruits like strawberry you don't need to peel the strawberry but um how are you going to eat it how are you going to enjoy it what um the, the writer the, the one who wrote this uh, choose to be healthy than to satisfy that you want to eat something okay I understand uh sunny yes yeah Great. i understand it Yes, yes. Okay, let's go to this part. So these are the new words that we learned today. Take turn. Yes, so take, take turns one meaning. another in. So yes, one, one another. another in order. So take turning meaning you first, another person second, and then third, yeah. then your turn. So that's take turns. Number two word. Resentment. A okay. feel of the displeasure and angry because of insult. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I understand it. Okay. Yeah, it's yeah, displeasure yeah. and anger and insult. Very good. You read it correctly. Next word. Shy away from. Back. Hesitate to do. Yeah, I got it. Yes, yes, shy away. I don't want to do it. I'm too shy. Shy yeah. away. <laughs> okay, next word is? Uh, palette. Yes, palette. Uh, palette. Palette. Yes. The sense of taste. Uh, yes. I, 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 I understand. Yes, yes, okay. I think there's a part in our tongue that... that um, um the, the 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 one that recognizes the flavor is palette okay um let's uh, explain segment number one uh sorry teacher i think we need to uh to finish Stop. yeah okay the lesson because, but sorry uh um, this saturday i busy, uh, ah, I'm busy. you will be busy yes Okay, so when and, will we? Uh, next uh, week, nala. Next week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, next uh, West, West, West day. Yes, yes, next Wednesday. No problem, Sunny. Have a nice day. Uh, have a nice Bye. day. Thank you, teacher, Bye. so much. Bye. <laughs> Bye. I hope you learned something today. Yeah. Bye to your cat also.